Hello everyone and welcome to our daily analysis videos with me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Hantech on Wednesday the 23rd of December. Now this is our final day of videos that we're doing this year and um, Euro dollar it has had a little bit of a corrective move um, in recent sessions, a little bit of a pick up today. And uh, it's interesting that I think you still continue to see Euro dollar bought into weakness. I think that the near term move is a mild negative bias, but essentially within a, a bigger picture uptrend. Um, you can see that this uptrend actually over the past few weeks um, has been breached now by yesterday's decisive negative candle. And you could argue that there is a slight corrective aspect of lower highs and lower lows now forming. But a little bit of an uptick, and it's interesting that the support is starting to form again around about this sort of breakout area. Um, get the crosshair going, and you can see that at all these old highs between sort of 21.50 and 21.70 continue to come in as a basis of support. All these um, old um, sort of breakout levels that we had previously, and the uptrend is still intact in the market. And the RSI has just come back to unwind towards the 60 mark, slight uptick. So I think that essentially we're still holding on to the fact that this is just a near term correction within what is still a bigger, pick, bigger picture uptrend. And as I said, the market ticking higher today really helps that move back above the 2170 mark again. So we're still looking positive, I think, on euro dollar um, and this is um, any sort of near term unwind is essentially just an unwind on the dollar um, weakness and I think that there's going to be further dollar weakness that will pull euro dollar higher in due course. Let's look at the, uh, the four hour chart, zoom out a slight amount here and you can again just see that this is just sort of chopping around recently. You could argue there is a, a head and shoulders top formation there if you went underneath that reaction low that we had around 21.20. Uh, and that would be a bit of a risk and obviously that would also be breaking the uptrend um, as well. So yeah, that's something that we need to keep an eye on. But essentially we're still looking at this four hour chart as just an unwind actually, because you've got the still positive momentum configuration on that RSI. And um, it's basically back into all these sort of breakout levels of support. So I think that um, as long as that uh, support, I mean, you'd be certainly looking for 2150 um, area to hold as support. If that continues, then you can still see that that is a, a positive outlook, I think. But um, yeah, the, the risk, I suppose, would be this turns into a head and shoulders top formation and then you get the market back down in the 20 area, maybe 19 area. But essentially, we're still looking for near term corrections as a chance to buy. And um, if this support does now start to build again, 2170 area, I think that that could be the opportunity. So with that in mind, I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos. Go to our website, sign up for our webinars and click to watch Trader Talks, our videos that give you top trading ideas.